<laughs> I saw Beecham Sonics work online and I was wowed by the intricacy and imagination of her work. This is art that I want to keep with me always. Wow, so this is all your artwork. Yes. I've never seen so much detail in different tattoos. And that's the one thing I think that's stuck out the most with when I saw your artwork. It's so incredibly unique. In Turkey, religious factions are trying to crack down on tattoos and piercings. Beecham is part of a new generation of young Turks determined to buck authority with beauty. It was telling me I had to have one of Beecham's pieces. To imagine that is going to be on my body. And her design of a spoon, a whisk, and a knife representing my life in the kitchen did not disappoint. Tattoos are forever. So every new one comes with a wave of anxiety. It's the moment of truth. I'm ready. <laughs> if I'm not, it's too late. <laughs> For me, tattoos are kind of a graphic autobiography. Whether it was the first job or first love, I have gotten one to celebrate each of my life's meaningful moments. So I want to mark this memory in ink. But even more so, it's about being here with her in this style of tattoo. We're sitting here listening to the call to prayer <laughs> as I'm getting a tattoo. It places you in Istanbul. Yes, it's such a surreal experience. The minutes tick by painfully slow when you're getting inked, but I get excited as Istanbul artist Beecham Sinek's designs begin to emerge. It is so stunning. You know, you read about different Asian cultures that have been tattooing for hundreds of years. Mm -hmm. Was Turkey one of those kinds of places? This tattoo has a lot of meaning for me. It's an expression of who I am as a chef and a bold, beautiful piece by a gifted young artist. I couldn't be happier. I think it's finished. Oh my god. <laughs> ah. Do you see the smile? <laughs> <laughs> I'm incredibly happy. Let's check it. <laughs> it's absolutely stunning. This isn't just body art. It's an indelible memory of Istanbul etched on my arm and in my heart.